What up, nerds? Welcome back to my Let's Play of Poke MMO, now with the Unova region, which I'm finally in after all this time. Uh, so it's been a little bit of time since my last update, so I need to kind of get myself sorted back out and back into the swing of things here. Uh, we just entered Castalia City, which I'm not sure what the the name is about. It, is it supposed to look like a castle? I don't know if it really looks like a castle. This really should have been where I got the bicycle, you know? I mean, look at me, I'm just running, 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 running straight past that Poke Center, and... Oh, jeez, and I'm still not over to where I need to be just yet. Um, I played this region a couple of times already, like I'd said before, so... I know that I need to go this way, but it's just... A really straight shot, and a bicycle would really eliminate a lot of distance there. Anyway, here we are. Oh, hey! I just challenged the gym leader, Berg. He's a seasoned gym leader. He made me work for that gym badge. But for me, Bug-type Pokemon aren't much of a challenge. And yeah, he'd say that even if he didn't have a Fire-type Pokemon on his team. I'm going to keep winning like this against all the Unova region's gym leaders. Then, I'll head for the Pokemon League and outperform the champion. If I do that, everyone will admit what a strong trainer I am. That will make me feel truly alive. Okay. Strength is not supposed to be an end unto itself. It's supposed to be a means to a different end. Aha! You're the one who fought Team Plasma in Pinwheel Forest. If I remember, your name is PF Novels. Come to challenge the gym, I suppose? Ah, oh, sorry, but can you wait a bit? I was informed that Team Plasma has shown up. In fact, come with me! I'm going to the dock at Prime Pier. Prime Pier, okay, so it's kind of important to remember that name because even if you've just, just come to this city, uh, well, you'd be tempted to go into this pier right over here. It's like, is this it? No, it doesn't even tell you up in this corner here. It just says Castilia City, Channel 2. But, is this the ferry that lets me leave? Nope, this is ju just a totally useless area right over here. Okay. Now, he said the Prime Pier, so I'm going to assume that it's the pier, like, in the mid-most area of the city. So, not this one. Is it this one? Like, this one's, like, pretty close to the Pokemon Center, so let's just have a look-see. Yep, it's this one. Come on, this way! Okay, here I come. Hi. Team Plasma, they took this young lady's Pokemon. Oh, of course they took Bianca's Pokemon, because she's too weak to defend herself. PF Novels, is there anything we can do? My Muna! Team Plasma took it- Yes, we've established that. I heard this lady scream and ran after the thief as fast as I could with my stubby little eight-year-old legs. But this city is so big and so crowded, I'm afraid I lost them. Iris, you did everything you could. But that's so bad! Taking people's Pokémon is really bad! Taking their guns is bad, too. Cause it's really nice when people and Pokémon are together. They each have something the other doesn't, and they help each other. What do I have that my Pokémon needs? Like, I don't feed them. So what, I give them experience in battle? You know, in, in every wild Pokémon I've battled ever, wild Pokémon are always able to move on their own, independent of any trainer commands. Granted, they, they do random stuff, so it's not like they're, you know, disciplined, but still, whatever. It's not like they need me. Iris, agreed. No fear, we will get that Pokémon back. Right, PF Novels? I don't respond, I'm a silent protagonist. Having said that, finding a person or a Pokémon here in Castelia City will be like finding a needle in a haystack. Oh, well, here comes the needle. Uh, I spy a gym leader? Last time went so well, I thought I'd grab another Pokemon. Rethinking, I need to get out of here. Running, 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 running. PF Novels, let's go. Iris, you stay by that young lady's side. Oh yeah, let's keep the eighth gym leader over here instead of chasing after the threat. I'm gonna be Bianca's bodyguard, so you go after those bad guys, okay? Why are you being Bianca's bodyguard? I mean, seriously, who's going to attack Bianca now? I mean, I guess in this world, more Team Plasma people might, but... I mean, I, this city is like a ghost city. This is the least amount of people in a city ever, but still, somebody would surely jump in to help. This way! Mm-hmm. They're headed towards the gym? Okay, I'm coming. Running down this very empty... Man, this is a ghost city. Look how empty this place is. Alright, there's Berg. Well, if you don't know where to go, it, it, you'll get lost here. This is definitely the place. You don't say! Did the three t team whatever plasma guys not, not tip you off? No one's here! Not a soul, except for the three of us. No other team plasma members nor any of the seven sages are inside. If you think I'm lying, why don't we have a battle and find out? Okay. I, I had a thought. I'll take care of this weak-looking runt so you can show off by handling that tough-looking guy over there. 
Oh, please. PF Novels, I'll leave that one to you. Okay. Um, I mean, if you say no, then there's no way that you're going to be able to go any further, so you have to say yes. Once again, it's a yes-no decision that makes no difference to the plot. You know, I don't mind yes-no decisions that don't make a difference to the plot, as long as they're really interesting, you know? Alright, so what do I want to do here? Fire Fang. Like, for instance, if there are those games that, uh, what are they called? Like, the Telltale series where, you know, either way that you do something, the person still gets, like, hit by a car or killed or whatever, but then you're, you're a better person because you made the right decision, even though you couldn't do anything about it. Alright, let's use Overheat, because I, I think that one strength still could have killed that thing off or a Fire Fang, but, eh, why risk it? I mean, this game drags out pretty long without the extra. Come on, seriously? All I did was try to take people's Pokemon away. <laughs> this is bad. Bad, 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 bad. Bad for Team Plasma or Plasbad for sure. Who wrote this? It's my best interest to get report to the Seven Sages right now. What Seven Sages? You mean the ones that aren't inside there? Phew, we got lost. Okay. Even with the directions from the X-Transceiver, I couldn't figure it out. Team Plasma is inside. The stolen Pokemon may be there as well. Okay, I'm going in. Alright. It's okay! This time I'll join the fight! Come, Bianca, you too! W wait! PF Novels, you come too! Okay, wh why am I being left in the lurch here? Alright, I'm coming. See, this is what I'm talking about right here! Me filling in a gap! What if- what if I walk over here? No, no, it forces me to move in there. See, I'm nothing but a gap to fill. At least in the other two gate regions, like, I felt like I was doing my own thing. Here, I'm just being dragged around by the dick! My word, if, is it, if it isn't the gym leader, Berg. So, what would you say the guiding principle is of Team Plasma anyway? Take what you want from people? I thought it would be amusing to prepare a hideout right in front of a Pokemon gym, but we were detected more quickly than I imagined. You are a dumbass, good sir. Uh, indeed. No matter, we already have an exceptional base of operations. Is everyone familiar with the legend of the founding of the Unova region? Yeah, why don't you set up a criminal base next to the police station while you're at it? I'm sorry, you guys. If you can hear that train horn, I apologize. It's... That freaking train's been blaring for an hour now. I thought it would have worn itself out by now, but nope. I guess it just has to keep reconnecting cars. Anyway, you don't want to hear about that. I am! It's a white dragon type Pokemon, right? Blue eyes, white dragon. Uh, that was lame, sorry. The truth is this. The White Dragon appeared before a hero who sought the true way to knit together a world full of many warring people. The, this White Dragon Pokemon shared its knowledge and bared its fangs at those who stood against it. Together, the power of this Pokemon and the hero brought unity to the hearts of everyone in the land. And that is how Unova was created. Oh right, a dragon and a person created a land. Well, okay. So, I get that maybe it created the ideals that make up the people of the land, but, you know, he should really just say that. We shall bring back the hero and that Pokemon to Unova once again. If we can win people's hearts and minds, we can easily create a world that, I mean, Team Plasma desires. Wait, so what? You're going to use force to bring people together? That's, that's not how bringing people together works. You have to convince them. With, you know, words and arguments. Here in Castalia, we have a lot of different kinds of people. Everyone's way of thinking and lifestyles are very different. Well, then you're probably going to have a lot of people fighting amongst each other, aren't you? Honestly, there's something about what you're saying I don't understand. Yes, what is it? One thing we all have in common is that we all care a lot about Pokemon. Not me. Okay, hang on. Not me? Pokemon are my slaves. Even people meeting for the first time can talk about Pokemon. Talk or battle or trade. Remember your speech at Accumulatown? You were responsible for leading me to rethink my relationship with Pokemon. For that I thank you. At that time, I made a promise. I swore to myself that I would dedicate myself to Pokemon even more strongly. Well, not strongly enough for me to defeat you, I'll tell you that right now, Berg. What you guys are doing, aren't you going to strengthen the bond between people and Pokemon even more? Mya-ha-ha-ha! You are quite hard to figure out. A little more intelligent than I'd expected. I am fond of intelligent people, you see. You'll enjoy hearing about this. From every corner of the world, I have gathered knowledgeable people for our king's benefit. You could call them the Seven Sages. Very well, we will submit to your opinion and be on our way. That girl over there, return her Pokémon! Okay... So... Th thank you! Well, uh, Mooney, I'm so glad to see you again! Bianca, why are you thanking them? They take people's precious Pokemon! It's just, I'm so happy that my Muna is safe! 
Bianca, you are the worst. You suck. You deserve to lose your Pokemon to criminal teams that train like this version of Rattata's. Get assist. The friendship between Pokemon and people can be very touching, but in order to liberate Pokemon from foolish people, we will revive the legend of Unova and win the hearts and minds of everyone. Farewell. Look, there are four people in this room right now who deserve to not have any Pokemon. The three guys standing behind you in armor and freaking Bianca. You were right to take away her Pokemon. I don't know why you turned back on that. Sage is my ass. Boy, this region pisses me off. Okay, what are you doing? Why are you letting them get away? Good question. Hey, better question, Iris, 8th gym leader. Why are you letting them get away? You got a level 43 Haxorus. Yeah, what, are, what do we do if anything's happened to other stolen Pokemon? It's okay. Thank you. I oh, shut up, Bianca. You did nothing. No one was hurt. More than anything, I got my darling Pokemon backy. The point of battling Pokemon is to hurt people. Well, they're, they're Pokemon. It's okay if you're happy. What is everyone planning to do now? Oh, it would be sensational to look around Constelia City, but... Don't worry, I'll keep being your bodyguard. You know, if you need a bodyguard as a Pokemon trainer, if your Pokemon are not serving their function as bodyguards, because that is their function, then you have lost, okay? You, ha you suck at life. Iris, mm-hmm, that's great. Iris is a dazzling Pokemon trainer, but maybe not at home in the big city yet. So, a little give and take. Hmm, people and Pokemon need to help each other out. Also, thanks for looking for the Pokemon. Here, this is for you, a Yake Berry that I'm never gonna use. Uh, see you! Well, we'll wait. Well, who's saying wait? Well then, PF Novels, I'll be waiting at the gym. Alright, I'm gonna beat your face in, but... Alright, I found a smoke ball. If I never, ever need to run away from something. Eh... I don't know if that was worth it, but it was sitting right there. Alright, so uh, you guys just got to sit through an episode of absolutely nothing but one Pokemon battle actually happening. It was just a bunch of blah 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 blah, but hey, that's this region in a nutshell. So let me show you this gym real quick, and then afterwards I'll, uh, I'll, I'll shut off for the day. Oh hey, you're not going to give me any water this time? What do you think? I'll bet with all the people you started to feel worn on your way to the gym. Eh, there were a lot more people in the actual game. Never mind, this will help, take it. I mean, like, on the actual game system, the DS. Like, in this game, they, all the people are gone, except for, like, a couple. The theme of this gem is walking through walls. The funny honey walls may look impassable, or even impossible. Um, you know. But if you can't get past them, then step on the switches. And if you step on the wrong switch, I kid you not, a clown will jump out and attack you. Alright, I'll see you guys later.